Hey guys, Lester, and welcome to another Minecraft video here on the channel. Today, I'm once again going to be tackling the slash locate command in Minecraft. I should mention this is a vanilla command. You do not need any mods installed for this. And this is a very nifty and convenient command for people that need to locate things. They're having trouble locating within their world that don't want to use any external websites to kind of reveal the entire seed of your world. That being said, if you guys want to fact check me, here's the seed of the world I'm going to be using today. So if you guys want to copy that seed and look it up just to, you know, fact check that I'm doing this correctly. I should also mention that I'm in version 1.17.1. I did this video once for 1.16. I forget which version in 1.16. But considering how much of a success it was, I plan on doing this kind of video for probably the foreseeable future of all the new Minecraft versions that come out in case there's any new structures that I want to test with this command and whatnot. So if you guys want to figure out how to use this command, stay tuned. But if you have been enjoying the video so far, consider smashing a like button to show your support. Maybe also consider subscribing if you're new. And let's hop right into this. So if you're wondering how to use slash locate, first things first is do slash locate. You can also locate by biome, but we're just going to be locating structures right now. So if I hit space, you will notice that it automatically uh, tabs in all these different um, structures that you can locate in your world. Now, this does work in other dimensions, I should mention so far. I noticed in my original video I made of this, a lot of people were asking if this works in the nether or the end. Keep in mind, this all works, but you have to be in a... The, the, like, it's hard to explain. For this to work, you have to load up the world in the version that you're in. You can't load up an old save file and expect this to work because if you're in 1.17 but your save file is for like 1.4, it's not going to be able to accurately know where stuff is. So to get the um, most out of this command, just make sure that you're in the same version that you load the world up in, etc. Don't make things too complicated. But let's just start off with something easy. Let's say I want to locate an igloo. So you will type slash locate igloo and hit enter. And it will actually give you the coordinates. I don't know why I'm like, why is my text so like, wait a minute. Let me figure this out real quick. Chat settings. Why is the text opacity so like, there we go. So if you want to go to this place, the next thing to do is just to click the coordinates and it will automatically type in the command for you. And you hit enter and you will teleport to these coordinates. Now keep in mind when you use the slash locate command, it sends you to the nearest one from your current vicinity. So... This is literally the nearest one. It was negative 1,500, 2,800 away. And as you can see, we're at an igloo. And unfortunately, it's not one of the special igloos. Sad. But it does bring me to the nearest igloo. Now, the other thing is, if you're typing in the command again, it's still going to bring you to the nearest one. So as you can see, it says 17 blocks away. Ironic number 17, huh? My lucky number. But you cannot go to a new one. The only way you go to a new one is teleporting so far out that this is no longer your nearest one, and then it will generate a new one. So although it does help you find the find the nearest one quickly, it does not find new ones after the first one. For example, again, if I do slash locate village and hit enter, it will bring me to my nearest village. So let's click the command there and teleport, and it will bring me to the nearest village. As you can see, I am here. Now, if I want to go to another village, it's not going to allow it. I'm right here. However, if I teleported like, let's say like this far out and then did the command again, slash locate village, it, as you can see, will bring me to a new village, as you can tell. Um, but once more, if you use the command again, it's going to only show this village, which sucks that it does this, but it makes sense because it would be a bit too overpowered if it did the other way. Keep in mind, this command is only meant to be used as a last resort, in my opinion. You're not supposed to, like, join a world and immediately do slash locate end city and go there. Like, it's meant to be kind of like, a, I literally have been traveling this world for decades. I can't find anything. I need to get to a town. Where's the nearest one? Done. Um, I should mention this does also work with modded clients. If you have a, a mod pack installed, certain mods might work with this as well. Like, if you wanted to locate, like something or Twilight Forest or whatever. It has to say specifically that it works for it, or you can just, you know, tab through in the slash locate command. Uh, if you see anything other than these locations, you can pot potentially locate them as well. But let's locate something more crazy, like a nether fossil. Oh, you can't find any structures nearby. So what that means is either it's in another dimension or it is there's none in your area. And I believe that means it's another dimension because nether fossil, I think, is in the nether. So... Let's look for something a bit more crazy. Let's look for, let's look for a, um, what are they called? What is it called? It's the, this is the one I always, actually, let's look for a ruined portal. Let's go to a ruined portal because this is a newer structure, right? Wait, why did it send me here? Oh, I did shipwreck. Oops. 
Well, I want to shipwreck. I want to go to Ruin Portal. Send me to Ruin Portal. Okay, I found an underwater. I didn't know what these things could be underwater. Anyway, so here's the Ruin Portal, as you can see, in its glorious self. But uh, the other reason I came here is because I wanted to actually go to the Nether. No, Dolphin! Don't die! Run, Dolphin! The Dolphin died. Really? I didn't want to kill a Dolphin today. That's sad. Okay. So, I wanted to prove this thing can work. You know, I'm an idiot. I don't know why I thought that would work on <laughs> Uh, please, please don't unsub for me for, uh, making such a rookie mistake. I know what I'm doing. I've played Minecraft for, like, ten years. Alright. Now that we're in the nether, as you can see, if I do slash locate, let's say, village, it's not going to work because you're in the nether now. And, ironically, I just found one of these right in the nether from my current nether portal. Oh, a mending shovel. That's pretty nifty. Anyway, slash locate. I wanted to locate the, um, let's locate a fortress. So first fortress we have located, teleport to, and as you can see, we are at a, a terrible fortress. The nether fortress. I love these pillars. I haven't been in the 1.17 worlds too, too much, but I, I love this generation. Anyway, um, the other place I wanted to locate was, what was it called? It was like the nether fossil. Oops. Um, not ocean rune. I want to do nether fossil. Nether fossil. All right. Teleport. Ah, these, yes. So, as you can see, it's these little bone structures, and these actually do count as a, like, um, landmark or location. So, pretty cool that you can locate these. Now, the other place I wanted to go to was the, um, the end. So, I'm gonna do slash locate. This is probably the most convenient one that you always want to locate, is the, um, end, not end city. I want to locate the... I can never think of what they're called, but first off, I wanted to show you guys that you can go to the, um, the mansions. So, let me quickly show you guys the mansion. Which is super far away, of course it is. So, yeah, as you can see, mansion. But I wanted to go to the, um, stronghold, yes. So, stronghold is probably the one that people want to find the most because, you know, it's the, 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 the stronghold for the, um, for the end. Now... This command has always tripped me up in Biomes of Plenty because sometimes that's, it like messes up the generation for the Stronghold in Biomes of Plenty worlds, as you may have seen in some of my modded survivals in the past. But it does work completely if you are in a regular world. Just keep in mind that it might glitch out if you're in a modded one. Um, but as you can see, we have found our, our nifty Stronghold. Let's head to the end. And let's get going so as you can see we are in the end we're in this place but we don't want to be here we want to go to an end city so let's look at the nearest end city and teleport and voila we are at the end city again keep in mind that while um these commands do work in these dimensions if you're not going to teleport or whatever it, it might be a bit tricky to locate them because if it tells you like to go 10,000 blocks away then you're kind of stuck you know but as you can see, it works in all three dimensions, the end, the nether, and of course, the um, overworld. Now, just to quickly show, I might want to make a separate video on this actually, but if I do slash locate biome, you can actually locate all the biomes. Let's say I wanted to go to the nearest beach. Boom. Sends me to the nearest beach biome. Uh, these commands are very handy, and while I do recommend using them sparingly, they are really good to have on hand. And Oh, look, a little turtle beach. That's so cute. Look at all the turtles. Um... But yeah, it, it can be seen and viewed as very overpowered. Personally, I would never use these unless I've left with no other choice. Again, you guys know me. I don't normally like to just teleport everywhere. I like to explore um, unless I absolutely have to or I'm playing like a mod pack where it's almost necessary. Uh, but for vanilla situations, it, it's a, it's like, it's up to you to decide. I'm not going to judge if you guys want to use these commands or not. But yeah, like I said again, if you do just slash locate, you can locate the Bastion Remnant, Bastion Treasures, the Desert Pyramid, the End City, the Fortress, the Igloo, the Jungle Pyramids, jungle, the Mansions, the Mine Shafts, Monuments, Nether for Fossils, Ocean Ruins, Pillager Outposts, the Ruined Portals, the Shipwrecks, the Stronghold, the Swamp Hut, and the Village. Those are currently the only vanilla structures that you can locate. Speaking of, I just locate one without having to use the command. Um, but again, they're... Like, they plan on adding more. Obviously, anytime a new structure is added, they will definitely um, make a... They'll add it to this. 
Again, it, it's made also for people that like use creative mode a lot. Why is this not lighting? Does it not light with these? I didn't know. I thought it did light with the uh, crying obsidian. Huh. Anyway, that's it for this video. I hope this was informative to you guys. If it was, definitely smash like button, share support. Maybe consider subscribing if you're new. And keep in mind, I'm going to say it once more. This command, they only work if you are in the respective dimension. And if it, the command still somehow isn't working, maybe you're not typing correctly, or maybe you are in a modded client where it might have messed up the generation and it might be displaying inaccurate numbers. So, if you're in pure vanilla, this should work without any issue. As to what versions it works on, I believe it works on any version 1.12 and above. I don't know about anything previous to that, but it should not cause you any issue. But yeah, that's going to do this video. I hope you guys did enjoy it, and I hope you all have a great day. Have a great summer. Stay safe, everyone. Goodbye.